This is a private matter. John stays. This is family. That's why he stays. Going in the wind as a pet, the other truth that it's naked is what they don't. Is a phone call possible? Phone call. John has a daughter. He may wish to say goodbye. Good luck, Boris. Good luck, Charlie. Hello, sir. <sighs> yes, no, no, I'm, I'm still here. I'm here. You went away. I'm sorry about that. We, we, we must have got cut off. Um... Wow, that's, that's a great question. I'm not completely sure. Um, now, I tell you what, you, you've got to be really, really brave for me. John. Yeah. Where are you? I don't know. Is Mycroft with you? I have no idea. I can hardly see anything. Mycroft? Abstract! Are you OK? Yeah. All right. John! John. Yeah. I'm going to find you. I am finding you. Hurry! Now, I'm just an idiot. I'm on the ground. I could bring you home. Open your eyes. <laughs> I'm here. You're not lost anymore. <laughs> um, um, Mycroft, make sure he's looked after. I'll take care of it. Thanks, Greg. <laughs> you okay? I said I'd bring her home. I can't, can I? Well, you gave her what she was looking for. Yeah, I didn't get the shopping. What? Why not? Because I had a row in the shop. Have you got cash? Take my card. That's it! Oh, God, it's been a shopping. Sure, you've got to see it. Yeah. Excuse me. Excuse me. I'll just slip off. No need to mention this in your report. Mr. Holmes. I have high hopes for you, Inspector. So. So nine mil, million. million, yes. Nine million for Jade Pin Dragon Den Black Tramway. A hairpin worth nine million pounds. Apparently. Look, it wasn't serious between us. He was my boss. What happened? Why did you end it? I thought he didn't appreciate me. He said he bought it in a street market. Oh, I don't think that's true. I think he pinched it. What's it worth? Nine million pounds. Oh, my God! You've been reading John's blog, the story of how you met. Helps him if I see myself through his eyes sometimes. I'm so much cleverer. You help me. You're right, babe. Miss me? Sherlock, are you all right? Yes, I know what survives that. I just went to the trouble of an overdose to prove it. Try to lure it. It'll sell. It's got proper murders in it, too. You're the expert. You want help? Yes, please. One condition. OK. Take all the credit. It's obvious, though, isn't it, what happened? But it's just you normally say that at this point. Hmm. He's handy and loyal. Maybe I would die for you. Anyone up for a trudge? Better luck next time. Hmm? This is it, though. You think you can go on saving her forever? Of course. Is that sentiment talking? No, it's me. Difficult to tell the difference these days. Nice trip. How the f Please, Mary, there is a child present. I will keep you safe. Everything will be all right, I promise you. A few moments later. <laughs> things were going and if there was anything I could do. Fancy some chips. What? I know a fantastic fish shop just off the Marlborough Road. The owner always gives me extra portions. Did you get him off and murder, George? No, nope, helped him put up some shelves. Sherlock? Mm. What was today about? Saying thank you. For what? For everything you did for me. You made it all possible. And congratulations, by the way. I hope you'll be very happy. You deserve it. Sorry.
How are you feeling? Yeah, not bad. Uh, sorry, it's just, um, you know, Rosie. Sorry, I, I wasn't thinking of Rosie. No problem. We should uh, come and see her soon. Are you okay? <laughs> you are doing yourself a disservice. I have known many people in this world, but made few friends, and I can safely say I cheated on her. Wait, 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 hold up, wait. <laughs> It's not okay. No. <laughs> but it is what it is. There will never be a TV scene as iconic as this one. You're in a mistake. Look at you. Yeah, well, I've got a friend with me, so. Bollocks. <laughs> but I don't work for free. You take cash? Not cash. No. Don't play with me right now. You know what I expected you. What? What am I? Nicer. Yes, of course I'm all right. We have just killed a man. Yes, sir. I am dismissive of the virtuous, unaware of the beautiful, and uncomprehending in the face of the happy. I never expected to be anybody's best friend, certainly not the best friend of the bravest and kindest and wisest human being I have ever had the good fortune of knowing. John, I am a ridiculous man, redeemed only by the warmth and constancy of your friendship. But as I'm apparently your best friend, I cannot congratulate you on your choice of companion. Just take a deep breath. Actually, now I can. Mary, today you sit between the woman you have made your wife and the man you have saved. In short, the two people who love you most in all this world. Mr. Holmes, you and I are similar, I think. Yes, I think we are. There's a proper time to die, isn't there? Of course there is. But not at John's wedding. <laughs> We wouldn't do that, would we? You and me. We would never do that to John Watson. Okay, James. You're already the best parents in the world. Look at all the practice you've had. You're hardly gonna need me around now that you've got a real baby on the way. The baby, baby. What was that? You said forever, now I drive alone past your street. And you think I like a drink? Occasionally. That I am a drunk. No, no. Am I a vegetable? You are the... <laughs> Funny. Thank you. I'm, I'm nice-ish. At least he called to say that we were finished. Hmm. I don't know, this kind of hurts my feelings or something. John, wake up. Oh, yes. <clears throat> rude, rude. Don't worry. I'll find him in ten minutes. What's your dog's name? We've had a scan, we're pretty sure it's a girl. Oh. <clears throat> Rosie, look at this. Oh shit, don't touch that whoopsie. Look, it's daddy high.